Welcome back to Groover Motor Company. Today we are going to show you how to repair your window regulator. First, you will use a T25 to remove the three screws that attach to the motor. Flip the regulator over and set the motor aside. Now that the cables move freely, manually move the window mounts to the lowest position. Remember the number of windings for each of the two cables and the reel for later. This plastic ferrule gets brittle over time and eventually snaps causing the cables to jump from the pulleys or bind the reel. We manufacture the ferrules at our machine shop using 6061 T3 aluminum rods. This aluminum alloy has both high strength and high corrosion resistance, making it suitable for this environment. Remove the lift cable from the upper left pulley by positioning the guide on the pulley as shown and lifting the cable through the insertion knot to the guide. Now, begin to rotate the pulley under the cable until the guide has cleared and help the cable over the shaft. You are going to need to cut the ferrule neck, so flip over if needed. Pull some slack in the cable around the plastic ferrule and carefully cut the thin end away. Please be gentle to avoid accidentally cutting yourself or the cable. You may find it easier to start at the bottom end and slowly working your way along the length of the barrel. Now let's remove the other end of the ferrule. Remove the reel, unwind the lift cable, and pull it out of the reel. The other end of the ferrule should slide right off the end of the lift cable. You may now install the replacement aluminum ferrule by sliding the lift cable into the body of the ferrule. Then, slide the spring over the bottom of the ferrule. Wind up the cables into the reel and be sure to wind each cable the same number of times as when they were removed. Now go to the end of the reel housing with the white plastic tension screw and completely clip off those two anti-backing clips on either side with a small pair of wire cutters. Install the white plastic tension screw and spring back into the reel housing. Wrap the cable around the upper pulley's insertion notch as shown. With your other hand, insert a flat blade screwdriver into either slot between the now removed anti-backing clips and turn clockwise to screw in the tension screw. Pull the cable until you get the blue clip installed. Rotate the pulley so that the guide passes under the cable and pulls it out around the pulley as shown. Congratulations. You have just rebuilt the Tesla window regulator.